Oh, is this not level 6 yet? Oh! Oh, that miss flash! Oh! Oh! That all. Yeah, he got. What? <laughs> what? That is a misclick that you are gonna be feeling like on with the. No! Why? <laughs>
Yep, Shelly gets to charge for free. There's only 20% oh. HP left, but now the and get from Bart. Trying to force the fight. Isles take a nice exhaust away from that when the Nidalee flashes, but for no good reason. The kill was guaranteed, and now the summoner spell is gone too. Good pick up there from INC. Yeah, yeah Ezreal got the gold. Uh, the shut down gold, and they get the dragon. They're gonna stacking the dragon solar real quick. It's 20, it's 12 minutes in and they got two dragons and it's mountain mountain is really good for both teams oh pull oh why did you flash oh that's unlucky and there's money legacy esports on the international stage was 2014 yeah. in the wild card tournament. Damn it, it's been a while. We don't even have oh! That anymore. Tristana this another kind of uh, got Reyes. his hard jump cancelled. Oh, that burst! Reyes nearly killed. Oh! Here's the forward play from the Ezreal. It's two, one already dead on the side of LGC. One on INTZ. Tally trying to it's one for one at the end. Sheeny barely hanging on to life here on the volley bear. The Nidalee spear almost takes him down. Tapoon is in the by the opportunity for some damage from Macau. Envy's oh, the puck, the puck. See some pings going through. Ray is nearly going to be killed. And now Tapoon's Damn, but it's not out of game, so he's 2v3. Oh, the stun. Brett stun. Oh my god. Macau, but he's not How? The kill and Bob gets in and cleans him up. The low health bars. Okay. This is what happened because they live so close because they have mountain drink all the three times coming out from the Vladimir they get the kill above him how in the hell did tally walk away from that one alive okay that's three people you could have if if they don't if they don't have dragon uh mountain Drake they got three kills guaranteed at the end of all that maybe like so many people but I assume that they will get the those kills if they don't have uh if legacy is sport doesn't have more resistance from Mountain Drake. Very punishing with the poke that they got. So like, imagine if they get four kills from that. That's gonna be so huge. There are so many tools to make an impact. You don't have much people following up here. So I thought he would have died too. Yeah, it looked like for sure he oh. would have been able to bite him, but the natural regeneration. Oh, you know, Folibear Bart combo is so annoying. It's gonna, it can shut down towers so, so long, for so long with Bart ult and then Folibear ult. They got Dragon, but at what cost? Camille got a uh, tower. No, wait. Yes, she got the tower. Tay is exhausted as he goes for the heat. Oh, leg onto Isles, re engage with the oh. touch line. Redbird is right there looking at the The butt stun almost caught. Like, if that's caught, like, Nidalis died as well. INTC are just catching Legacy off guard time. And he's, get, you know, pushes the wave in too much alongside uh, Isles. Gets caught off. Oh, that aggressive uh, hook so shot or something. Spot. Oh, wow. Israel got deleted. What the hell? Israel, his second death of the game, getting picked off here. As waiting to get set up with sub 30 seconds left, they already want to be down there clearing. If INTC got uh, Mountain Soul now, it's gonna be so huge. Oh! Oh! Tristana is gone, baby. It's deleted, and it's the it's perfect timing. Because I don't think Tristana ha will have time to go contest Mountain Soul, but Legacy Sport must contest it. Oh, oh, or backdooring. Well, I don't think they can end, but. Oh, nice Bart binding. But it won't matter. Well, is it is it a good threat though? I know that they they got uh inhibitor, but it's the top line inhibitor because it it's not the worst place to get. 
take down this dragon a little bit faster. Legacy don't have the resources. Unless if they get bot what bot lane. Mountain Soul going the way of INT. It'll be like long lane for the top lane in here. The farthest lane for to Baron. So I think it's worth because they got mountains uh mountain soul. They got more shield and more resistance. They knew the soul fight was doomed and they got what they could get in trade. Now there's deciding, hey, this is our go button. I, I think I'm INTZ is uh they guess they come back. They should go for this fight. I think they scaled better as a team. Oh no. The Baron got uh, got uh stalled under their nose. Oh Tristana? One for one. Oh, look at the resistance. What? <laughs> Thinking everything. And now Tilus sacrifices himself so the other can save. Now, they got Baron, but they lose three members. Is it worth it? No, I don't think it's worth it. Because even though Legacy had the goal have that Baron enchantment on the minions, sleep Oh, the tower's gone. Oh, ni now nice ult from Bart, but there's no follow up. Oh, nice hook. Is it in fight time? Oh, down. damn. Volibar is tanky, but he's not tanky enough. He needs to use the, uh, the ult defensively. It's it's one for zero, and there is chasing. Nobody's dying, man. <laughs> Look at the hulk. There's a full. They have a lot of speed between their champions. Sleepy trouble bubble comes through. can chase all day. Sidestep it. They get out of the way. Redbird's still chasing after him. Even Bart is so tanky now. Start the previous fight off. It's not ready to go here again. INTZ not willing to back away. Tally's still hanging around. Isle's still hanging around. Bottom lane tier one turret. Oh, it's 4v4. Envy's hanging out in this brush. The ward sees where he's at. So Legacy should not end up in a battle. It's 4v5 now. Just yet. Sheenie on the volley bear still here in the fight. No, the, the, it's just skir small skirmish. It's not, over. Not it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Or is it? Or is it? Zoe is so quick. <laughs> oh, another Bard ult. And now the Bard ult. He's ready to go here again. This oh, is Tristan is gone. But the flank IMT's from Camille. Fans, it's too late. Oh, they can come back from this. No legacy left to speak of if I Three for zero. Tay goes on a rampage. The Vladimir has scaled. Welcome to Count Vladland. <laughs> huge this game. Three. And you can see that lovely mountain range of blue there in your gold graph. The mountains are starting to get a little bit shorter. Not a lot just yet. Still a fourth. Yeah. Here for Legacy you know, Legacy Esport is, is on lead, but they don't feel like it. Oh. Omrecker. Now they are, they are too low to contest anything. And look at the INTC team. Everyone practically full halt now. <laughs> Sayonara, see you later. Oh, the hook. Fabir must use... Uh, well, uh, I mean flash. Showmaker. Oh, fast breaker. It's 4v4. They this is down. Oh, look how tanky they are. Oh, but is it? Oh, it's not strong enough. From these two players of Legacy Esports. Oh, look at <laughs> that! Nidali Hill is cheating. So perfectly timed by the set. Very well done by the Nidali. But now, oh. The man is cougar food. That's the kind of fight that Legacy needs. In this game, this game is a chock full of messes and a chock full of creativity from Legacy. Always trying to pressure INTZ to respect that side. I think they they do, they should wait for Tristana to get the dragon. Oh, and they're fighting for that elder. They they Vlad is here to try to stop him. Nidalee has no smite. 
The Elder Drake is fully stealable by the Vladimir because oh. the does not have a smite to be able to secure this. Oh, so that's right really close. Okay, Elder Drake secured that was big. They couldn't afford to lose that one. Tay goes into stasis trying to keep him. I think this is over. Pool now used burst coming down. Breathe your breath, Mr. Elder Drake. That damage is extreme. Still have a great counter engage ready for him. Um, yeah, I can't get anything here. I I don't think I NTZ can defend. In ten seconds time with Redbirds, uh, against Turtle. Baron Buff. Bottom lane tier three. And constant speed concentrate from Camille. Minion, and there you go, it's gone. Elder Buff has dissipated. Yeah, and this is just slowly no bleeding from their uh the from their ass. <laughs> Inhibitor is gone. Oh, That's inhibitor now in they're trying. Days. Oh, the burst. Followers saying blood, but oh, the Tristan now. Oh, Tay's been killed at the onset of the fight. They're able to find to disengage. The enemy, Vlad, but it's going to be a trade one for one. Oh, but Camus die. Sheenie's still tanking up at the front line. Tally going to be doing the same. Sheenie's out of the picture. Ray is grabbing the kill. Now, INTZ. Oh, the burst. The is a three -man. Oh, they, they can defend. They can defend. The fast breaker missing. The stun. Stunned up in the wall. But them. INTZ in a 3v3. The, the healing. Use this in hit. You are drowning in a. He's got Bob in right next to the heals. They're trying to end. In front of him to be able to provide the tanking. Look at how quickly. Oh, this is over. This is over. Yeah, they did it. GG. The amount of damage coming out from Legacy East. Damn. What a fun game. GG, man. But it's unlucky for INTZ. Starting a day with zero two, it's not good. Game from Legacy because Kongui had these other scaling picks because we know Peanut's gonna be playing the likes of the Grave. Peanut, huh? Andre, the oh yeah, the LG Peanut so is in LGD. The name of the it's been a while, my dude. A whole lot more as we move forward. You know, I have kind of soft spot with player who was ex player in SKT because I'm a huge fan of, of SKT. And we'll see if the Leona band comes but, out as well from PSG. Uh, Lilia has been you know, like I said before, so I would love to see, see uh, up, an upset. So Lilia right now, yeah, I Lilia think I'm gonna uh, uh, is that cheer on that PSG. Times, come on, man. Game, game four, let's go. On that champion. She does have some pretty good uh, interactions with the ability Pike. on the uh, on the PSG team comp, but it gives a bit more of a play back style for. We go with Pike PSG. The engage and then turn it back on PSG's head. Uh, Rock on. Bot lane options for Kaiwing. Playmaking is the name of the game for this guy, and especially when you have. Gene Rock on. How interesting. You chuck that Oriana ball onto Rakan's head, and Kaiwing is going to have all the tools he needs to find those fights. It is the first time we. We have seen Kai Wing on this Rakan though in the entirety of summer. So obviously trying to bring something new, maybe feeling a little bit more of the burden on him as one of the two players of the PSG so the main roster. PSG has really strong engage, but they they cannot split push at all. Yeah, well, Lucien can uh, easily split push around. Like the Rakan matchup into a Braum, it's really hard to get punished. By 16, MSI 2017, Worlds 2017, GA, MSI 2017, Worlds 2017. Ah, uh, you know, I kind of miss uh, when fans can cheer at the stage. So it gives me so much hype. I kind of. No, I'm not kind of. I miss that. You know, the, the sixth player of the team, the fans who cheer at the stage. But it is what it is. There's not, uh, there's nothing they can do. The stage is really cool, damn. You know, I, I cannot wait for the world's final to see what kind of augment reality they will pull off later. You know, it looks legit, the augment reality, the augment reality thing. It doesn't look like CGI at all. It's so impressive. How did they do, how did they do that? Because after the round robin, bottom team is out. PSG do need to show up, and with a comp like this, come on, let's go. Game four. Coming last in the group is a lot easier because they pick towards the top side, River. Uh, but these are the types of moves that Kaiming especially is going to consistently try to look for. Oh, okay. 
I think he did. He's playing down towards the bottom side. The smoke screen. Oh, he's, he's just say hello <laughs> with the smoke bomb. Here by Shie just makes it so different. Slow things out, chilled out for for just a little bit. And oh, I think they're trying to contest Dragon. Neutral objectives later on to the game, which is exactly what the Orn, as you said, is. Well, the the lens was in their advantage, so I think Lydia can solo Dragon. Really good matchups for LGD, and it's allowing Peanut to very easily farm in through the jungle. So and Gref is not uh, in a good position right now. We can expect him to see, you know, the the conversion of this early pressure into objectives. You know, Peanut's down there right oh. now as Kaiwing looks for a little bit of poke, but that should be a very early dragon here for LGD. And you can see there exactly why it is uh, why it is hard for Rakan to play in this two v two. We just get a lot. See this help. And you don't yeah. really get anything out of it. Peanut low here, but he has the smite, and there is no pressure on the map on him at all. Kongwei is up on the top side. Peanut will get the first dragon of the game. It's a mountain next infernal position for the Soviana to be in. Look at this though, Kramer level six walking up oh, through river. PSG they're trying to get uh, referral. Uniboy does have the flash to escape. No cleanse though. Uniboy is just uh, pretty safe right now as he backs away. Mark and Kramer trying to team up. But how unfair is this? He's doing Scuttle Crab and Herald at the same time because top and mid lane are winning so hard for him in terms of pressure. It's the, it's the push pressure that we talked about earlier on. Yeah, it's basically everyone's, every lane is winning right now for LGD. Fight against this. Colin coming out, Kaiwing battle dancing away, looking for the grand entrance, yet to hit six, doesn't have the quickness. And that Rift Held, the eye has opened and the oh, down. Oh no. <laughs> and hit Kai Wing, but he will be more than safe on the back line. these are the types of rooms that i really oh come like. on where's the blood bed this is lpl lpl team where's the blood bed where's the kill who didn't have pressure on the top side and who did not have game is too slow man i would have much rather preferred to see d and curl but instead it just ends up being a lot of wasted time because now peanut gets a lot of these turret plates for free Call of Fortune coming out from Hanabi. He's just going oh. to clear out this wave as much as he can. Peanuts on the chase. Uniboy's on his way. Oh no, he, now he doesn't have ult. Is disrupted and Hanabi flashes away. Peanut gets the kill and Yang Zing tanking up the tower. We'll just be able to walk away. Uniboy looked for some chasing, but couldn't get close enough. It's just a really good dive there from LG. Yeah, that's that textbook diving. Also, or just use his ult so it doesn't matter. So it's easy to dive him. And Folibert can just uh, overbreaker the tower. <laughs> To that rift trail, so that one can be placed a little bit later for even more bucks. Of course, the stormbringer stopping the tower. From but come on, man! Where's the fire? Yeah, this is can. This is too slow. DPS I'm feel sleepy now. And, uh, it's a good first dive here for oh, LGD. World. Mana Moon stacking up. He is going to have so much damage. But PSG will claim control of the river for the moment. Hanabi has. Oh, the arrow. Charter crystal arrow. Kaiwing dodges away. Real close. Kaiwing's going to be used on Uniboy, but he uses the dissonance and the shield to get himself. What? <laughs> what? It's bang at worlds all over again. <laughs> I think that might be a bit of a. <laughs> 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 He's like calculated. That's the target I was going. For. Imagine oh, that it, it interrupted. It was prey. It, was it was prey. prey. It was yeah, prey. Yeah. Say. Good one. Uh, but <laughs> <laughs> it does slow things down for a little bit. PSG not committing here, even though PL super server. <laughs> uh, so Rift out with the next target here for LGD. Peanut's gonna get it. Uh, they managed to get the first. They got the first dragon. And now the Rift Oh, oh the shock wave. That's really nice. Follow up engage. They dive onto Mark, who flashes away. Conway just has enough oh. damage to get the kill. And PSG Unfortunately, the, uh, really the quickness right didn't see. get Lucian. So he didn't get Charm. Oh, look at how fast Lily is. Uh, Rift Held for a support's life. In exchange, going to be spawning into the game. Whereas Long Shing, he has his TP re earned and ready to go. He's going to be able to go back oh, to base. Oh, uh, Top himself up. Mark once again steps forward, takes about a third of his HP. Oh, no. Give her the arrow and it can Oh, there. That is a very dead Kongwe, although he manages to escape. That's asleep. Going out as well. Oh, the shock wave, really nice. But Folly Bear. Oh, nice. Force God. Oh, the comeback. He's stuck in the middle of five players, but he's going to try and retreat through the jungle. Gets back into the river. One kill for PSG. Really good punish there from PSG. Baiting LGD back, surviving against the initial... Damn, that's really nice. Around on them inside that tight oh, jump. we are not done yet. Longshing's just going to flash straight forward. The what? As Uniboy joins the, the party. Stormbringer used by Longshing to get one stoppable to stop that route from coming in. Is, is Longshing just uh, uh, flash W with Volibear? <laughs> 
Oh, that's not sleep. Nice. GG. It's not end yet. Damn, give me the upset. Everything is practically up right now. It's gonna be a bloodbath. Come on. The ward in the river means that Hanabi is on vision. Oh, Arnold. Oh, no. Oh, but they got it. Anyway. Grass, grass. Oh, the sleep. Come on, you got this. PSG, let's go. Oh, it reset. It reset. Let's go. Oh, nice. Rakan knock up. Jin. Yes. Oh, Lilia is too quick. No, no, don't chase her. Don't chase Peanut, please. You waste so much time. No, what are you doing? Well, if you take down the jungler, perhaps you can. Longxing, 12 seconds, GA 10. Peanut just dodging away as much as he can, popping the Gen G. As he continues to run there, the back up. And Peanut will. Ah, I don't think it's worth it. What the hell? The Baron, they have evened out the gold. They were 2,000 gold behind. This entire. You, you just waste time and you. Uh, you don't even set up the Baron vision. I'll be honest, I came in thinking PSG. Yeah, the jungler is dead, but. You cannot do anything about it. Let's look at the fight. The ulti is terrible, but the idea is the uh, Oriana, yeah. of course, as we said, PSG in a much better position to fight at, in these consecutive fights when those flashes are down. So things starting. Oh, they're baiting. Right they want to turn onto LGD as soon as they approach from the river. I don't think they they want Baron. They just want to bait it. Yeah, they they're just baiting for teleport. Oh, oh nice kiting. But the dragon, uh, the baron is still low. Oh, oh! The shockwave from Uniboy is absolutely huge. Mark falls. Kramer's chased down by. Damn! They even get Baron. LGD are having flashbacks to 2015. Oh, that Rakan shockwave. PSG with an incredible fight of Baron. PSG have come up to play here. They're smashing Oh, Rakan, Rakan. Should be able to take him down. It's close at the end, but it will be GG. For the PCS representative. Five for one and got Baron. Second best team from the PCS. Let's go, PSG. Like, I'm looking forward to much. Teams on D. Rapid fire, phantom dancer, infinity plus one edge. The Ludens echo, echo, echo. The Rabadon's dead. <laughs> Come on, man, big. Just think you want to go for Medjai's. Death dance, obsidian cleaver, and the warrior enchant for Kongwei. Like, they are so strong. Look at this from LGD, though. They spent time up here. They want to find the pick. Can they make it happen? I'm going to be flash. You, you can't do it. Oh. <laughs> you can't get in there, and now you've got three players on the top side of the map. And no That's team. underwhelming, PSG but... PSG are down bot side. It's two versus one. Long Xing, he can't clear away mini waves. PSG are going to be able to raise this turret so, so quick, and they might get a kill on top. Now Long Xing goes in down to half HP. He's going to retreat. He's going to walk wounded back to his base. And meanwhile, oh, walk of shame. Walk with Tails behind their egg, behind their back. The mid -wave Set the expression. The wave will not be as strong as it could have been about orientated style. All five players in that blue quadrant. They know Damn. up in 20 seconds. Our GD map is in the bottom lane. must be so be dark. Mid, and then they just choke out. And it's basically free baron. He's down on the bottom side. He's like there's a scuttle <laughs> <laughs> He's just singing. He has nothing else to do. 
Baron is spawning, but how do you enter the river? That is exactly what LGD have to be asking themselves because it is do or die around this objective. PSG, if they get this, they will break open the entire base. So it's down to 8,000 HP. If you're not looking for the it's really hard, unless if. Two level disadvantage on his smite, though. There's the swell seed. Hits Kaiwing. Oh. Damn, nice this up from Rakan. Oh, Ocean Soul! Ocean Soul! It's over! Quarantine because of visas and PSG do not give a damn whether you're the LPL. Let's go! A little bit too far, caught up, but he's gonna be able to escape, get back underneath the tower, and now they're going forward. Look, damn, they, they tried their best, but it's Baron buff and it's five versus three. Okay, GG. Damn, PSG looks really nice. Right there, PSG and by God, they absolutely did. What a performance from PSG. You can see them elated at the end of it. <laughs> Good job, end. boys. I mean, they have no more games today. They've got some time to reassess, to reevaluate, but they really need S to do something. Because Starting 2 is really good PSG at the day one. The in this group. And actually, I think that's oh, they really show up. what a game. You know, the whole tournament, at the beginning, it's really slow, but from the globe, at the, at the mid, at the end, and, and game, Ryan it's really USA, fun battle. That shock web. The like stage, multiple the times and maybe he'll get a reason to celebrate in game five our na versus eu showdown hi everyone my name is ryan also known as fear no shadows and as you can see i'm an avid con well player. uh my favorite i guess it's time, time to take a break again got i'm gonna refill my drink now and take a break and licorice managed to steal the baron so see you at game five when there's a reason, Cadre, we've jammed these two together. Now, I feel like both of them have different playstyles, right? Shadow's the aggressive one you saw in game one today. I mean, he was going for plays which you would not expect to work. They didn't work in the end. He yeah. looked like he was griefing. He was the imposter. You got it right, guys. He was not playing so good. <laughs> in general, Broxo was the passive one. He's not really the one to look for those kind of plays. He's the one following, oh. covering his lanes, looking you for know, the objective. So in this game, I'm going to cheer style. on uh, Team Liquid goes, is because Broxa is so cool, man. It, He's so manly. I guess it might be Graves. And I mean, Shadow, it, it's going to be a whole lot of fun. And Let's go, boys! Brox and NF versus EU! This is his first time playing against LEC competition <laughs> since he left the... ...headlines will be uh, just a benefit for them, getting more time on the stage. Of course, look beautiful. I was blown away by it when we did the opening ceremony, I'll be honest, but... As we get on okay, it's begin. Bands with Team Liquid on the blue side of Mad Lions on the red side. The expectation is <coughs> that Lilia get removed by Mad. Excuse yeah, me. All, uh, you fans of the LCS, you'll know this is the first time we get to see Jat. Let's go, TL. He's on stage. He's on stage. He's on stage. Between these two jungles. Okay. Graves removed. I wonder if this is just a Lee Sin for Broxon. See, this is why I'm like, I'm not sure the Lee Sin priority is actually. Lee Sin! They actually oh! oh! Okay, because here's the thing. Broxa like, wanna flex Lee with his Lee Sin no back in 2018. Very good as well, but for him to say, yeah, him one was shaky. Twitch! And Rakan. Oh, oh. Any punches here. Twitch is gonna be showing up in the bot lane. And Core JJ. The Damn. They already picked some cheese and they picked pick. the champions so quickly especially alongside a twitch could be looking towards the bottom side of the map with yes. that first tfo yeah definitely it's galio oh so come they want to do camille galio mad lions it's gonna be the leona this is a champion kaiser does love and oh it's leona okay right now mad lions have so many really strong pick tools and it's a good cc though they have so many cc like really really if leona can CC someone, they'll get uh, stunned by arrow and you know, stun, charm, and stuff. But for the bot lane themselves, they, they already have so many CC that it makes Rakan's harder to uh, to do Grand Entrance because j just by one Q from Leona, it can just stun uh, Rakan. You know, stealth war when Rakan going in, so much of his time and he'll get this combo full CC. Of the early game. Crazy. Next to tactical, like he is out of there on Bard, it's like 30 Come on, this is the last game. I'm hyped. The expectation is 
Core JJ will be teaming things like the Mordekaiser to isolate you in team fights with the Twitch there as well, who can look for these flanks. Okay, let's go. They cannot go hell for that leather. They cannot go back on Bronx, where in his first clear, he couldn't find a gank. He has red spike. Oh, nice. Edge goes in in the bottom lane. Kazi knocked up here. Heal coming out. Tactical forced away. Only has the cleanse left. Exhaust used. Tactical is going to try and flash, but Kaiser's still on the chase. Well, it's uh, Flash and Exhaust for heal. And this now really low. He's left Biscuit. Oh. So if he doesn't want to contest it, he decides to recall. I know they are outnumbered. Good job. I don't know why Shadow doesn't want to. She's ahead and she's not really that low. I guess she just want to finish her item. Oh, the burst, the burst. They should has wait for. Uh, they should wait for Syndra. Oh, I don't think. Uh, Leona wants that. Oh, oh. One for two. Nice. Oh. Koye getting this respect. But it's fine. Oh, the stun. Which is cleanse. Oh. Get poison. Let's go, TL. Oh. Kick, 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 kick. Oh. Just gonna force Shadow away for the moment. Kaiser's back here with half HP. Wait, Impact has teleport. I mean, Impact just ulted top lane. He's fighting Rome. Rome still has the hex that Golda made him. Boxer. What's happening? Oh. Top lane. Top lane. Impact just wins. What? <laughs> you saw it on the mini map. More Kaiser one v one. Oh. He's ignited. Ticking. Oh, so he's burning away. Ticking away. Boxer taken out by Kaiser as well. We're jumping all over the map. After that crazy stuff, the gold is pretty much even. What the hell? <laughs> I want to see what happened at top lane. Is it like double, you know, like double trap? Combine your hashtag ultimatum and then get sent into Shadow Realm. Impact is just an incredibly strong Mordecai as a player. Oh, nice pull. Impact just gets a good E right there. When does he pop the ulti? Oh! oh. Yeah. I do like that a lot. So as soon as Arome commits the CC ability, the damage ability right there, and the E pop the arc, you know he's trying to run away, and then he's just sort of stuck down here, falls the flash. And Damn. And Brox is that even if you have good disengage, their engage is not telegraphed at all. Like Shadow, Ooh. once again, just trying to find a pick here onto Brox that forces him to jump away, forces him to use the control ward, and like... Humanoid could just pop the scatter the wind oh. as well as Mad Lion. So here's the quickness. Dives onto Kazi as Kazi takes a long oh. time. Heal coming out, but there's Destiny. Tactical. Kazi will fall. He tries to put the damage back. Tactical. Got to go down. 3 v 3 3 v 2 Auto apart from, from Impact. For Humanoid. TP behind them as Mordekai is going to try and join this fight. Kaiser is not done. Slowly walking on a singly. Here, trying to help Team Liquid get something back out of this. But Mad Lions are retreating through the jungle. And they managed to escape. Oh, nice stun. Yeah. From Humanoid. He found a good couple of it's two for one. Fight and Mad Lions walk away with two kills. Through Team Liquid's jungle, they get a lot oh. of that play. And there's no better feeling than towers going down as this Evelyn. Look at this. This is blood. Oh, oh. Who's trapping who? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I will say, <laughs> get him in fact, as, as an LEC card, such a BM. Disappointing today. It's about to get really interesting. As soon as, like, Mad Lion's mid lane outer tower goes, but they got they, they stuck in Dragon. For both teams who have really insane pick, they Next is Mountain. Tools as well. When these towers fall, 
Evelyn becomes so much more powerful. Twitch, the same TF2. Well, this is good for both team. Oh, quickness. Nice charm. Nice pull. Nice. Team Liquid happy to gobble up that kill. Just very odd jumping forward there with. Also, Twitch just got free gold from tower. Possibly get second tower as well. Damn, he got so many gold. Uh, gonna have a bunch of gold in the bank. Now the gold is back in front of Shadow. Shadow will stop oh. him with the smite. Jensen's gonna lock in the gold card. There's the solar player. The oh. out as well. Stopwatch will keep Jensen alive for a second. Oh, the flash. Flash followed by Kaiser. Oh, what card? Broxa. Oh, shh. Nice kick. Flash kick. Oh, they're alive. Oh, exactly. The item. Mordekaiser is still strong. Oh, nice flash. Oh, the burst. Mordekaiser, Mordekaiser. Still someone. One for one, two for one. Let's go, Impact. He's stuck in the death realm, and there's nowhere to go. All right, TL. Three for what? Three for two. In their favor, even losing tactical impact showed up in that. And more guys are so rich. Like he he just got six hundred shutdown gold from Syndra. And Sindra just lost all her, her stacks. Oh, look at the web clear. That's really nice. Feels really good. Oh, oh the arrow. But that's that run. <laughs> it's one v five. Oh no! Come on, impact. Oh! Oh no! Unleashed power was invested there by Humanoid. He wasn't letting him. Control wards are placed. Tells me where these teams want to fight, especially because of the stealth champions in this game. So TL set up around Baron. They're always going to cheat towards the left side of the map. <laughs> that Cindralic recall. <laughs> That's so rude. That Don't bully the picks, crap. But around a Drake. <laughs> there we are, humanoid. Just enough gold on the red buff, but he's trying to find a really deep angle. But he can't come around that oh. wall to his left because of the shadow is floundering about. Oh, he's going for it though. Oh, more guys, sir. Used on a Rome. Shadow's in the right position here. Does have the flash if he wants to he, dive he, forward. Man, he must have used flash. Oh, the stun. Oh, Syndra West is so quickness. Shadow. Oh, just one bonk, <laughs> and the Flynn is gone. Oh. Oh, Broxa. That's Shockwave. So does Kaiser, but Tactical's on tactical's the chase. But Impact isn't used at the right time. He's dead to the Unleashed Power. It's so close in some of these moments. And right now... Oh, another fight. Oh, Korjeje, oh, that CC. More than Kaiser. Oh. Another West Old. GG four for zero. Mad Lions looking desperate, and TL are just better in the team fights. Tactical refuses to die, and Impact, time and time again, is just destroying Mad Lions on the back end of the fight. I think this have old and flash. She cannot do anything. She cannot steal it. There is no way. The stopwatch, a work of genius there, as you could see, humanoid invest the cleanse, invest the flash, invest everything in trying to get on towards the twitch, and he just can't do enough.
Because I mean, Ooh, let's go, TL. To do everything, and he has no time for it. Jensen goes in, but of course, with Mad Lions just uh, trying to work out an avenue of approach, trying to work out something to do. They have yeah, if Mordekaiser finishes his. Uh, spirit Visage He'll become so such a mess and there is no way he can get assassinated Oh, gold card The pool Perfect CC Come pick this <laughs> Of this game. 10 seconds left of the Baron buff. Can they actually break this turret with Arome down? I don't think Mad Lions can threaten humanoids in the top Come side. Come on. Too, so this one is gonna fall. Just get the just get the turret. Oh, they're all really wide. Yeah. That one doesn't clear away the minion waves, but Shadow is here around and he reveals himself too. What are Mad Lions doing? Quickness coming out, Core JJ. Oh, the bull! The, the bull quickness. To it! GG! Very nice. Welcome back, TL, to Wards. Team Liquid claim North America's first win. Oh yes, GG. Oh, such a good game. Team Liquid playing the team fight game from TL. Down on the Mad Lions team, also shaky and a loss. And it's important to remember that this team really found. Oh, what a game! What a day! But it's uh, it's just a day one. To the international stage, I'm curious if they can turn it around in the next game. Yeah, I, I guess it's time to work this up. The video is too long. It's being too long. So let's go back to my room. Ah, we are back. So th that was the end of Words 2020 Day 1. Oh, I'm so exhausted. So I, I won't say uh, anything too long. I, I just want to rest. And if you like this video, please consider to like and subscribe to support the channel. <laughs> and also thank you very much for watching this video together with me. I really, really, really appreciate it. And this is something that I would love to do. You know, uh, watching words together with friends. And. Maybe you can tell your stuff about words so far, even though it's still day one. So yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, I see you guys later at the day two. Have a lucky day. Ah, is it over? Oh, I'm so exhausted. Oh, got you. Yeah, yeah I I'm just done. Uh, you know, <laughs> it's been what six hours. Yeah, it's 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 so long, man. Wanna go sleep with me tonight? <laughs>